Weather Authority. We warn you first. And while we have mild and muggy conditions this morning, once again, a weak cold front is knocking down our door. As we do notice, if you look really closely at the night sky, we do see those clouds, and we could be seeing chances of rain this afternoon. And speaking of our rain, we do notice that we have some in the basin, especially in the southern basin. We even have a line of thunderstorms in the far northeastern part of the basin that's really impacting places like Borden County as we speak. Moving off out of our viewing area heading towards places like Snyder and we actually do have a severe thunderstorm morning that is about to expire within the next couple of minutes. It does mean that frequent lightning, small hail and damaging winds are possible with the storm but again it's moving off to the north and east and there we go. It has since just expired. It's 515. So that's something to keep in mind. Still strong storms heading out if you're heading towards Snyder from Midland and Odessa. We also have some lingering rain showers in the southern basin that will continue to move off into the north and east, impacting eventually places like Odessa and Midland. And we will be seeing very dreary conditions today. So make sure you guys have the umbrella handy as we do see those temperatures warming up into the mid to upper 70s as opposed to be into the low 90s yesterday. Not quite as breezy and very dreary. A lot of clouds hanging around as we head, especially as we head into the evening hours, slowly but surely drying out later in the evening. Now current temperatures in the mid to upper 60s about an hour ago, it was sitting at 76. We do notice the sharp cutoff with these temperatures in much cooler air as we head in places like New Mexico. Temperatures in the 50s, those temperatures will continue to drop up over the next couple of hours into the low 60s in places like Odessa and Midland. It will be warming up today into perhaps the low 80s in the Trans Pegasus. That'll be the hot spot, but mid to upper 70s in places like Odessa and Midland before cooling off once again as we head out and about in the overnight. Very dreary conditions, but starting to clear out slowly but surely with the overnight low of 58 degrees. Any rain showers ending early, mostly before midnight. Now tracking those rain showers, we do see those rain showers from the south move up to Odessa Midland later this morning, eventually even into the afternoon. But we do notice much more in the way of clear skies and drier conditions as we head out and about for tomorrow. And speaking of those temperatures tomorrow, they'll be warming up as well into the mid to upper 80s. So we do notice that while we do have a weak cold front, it will be really starting to warm up, especially as we head into tomorrow with abundant sunshine and windy conditions. We'll get a reinforcing shot of cold air, especially as we head later tomorrow, knocking those temperatures into the low 50s tomorrow night. And then high temperatures will be in the 70s and overnight lows in the 30s and 40s as we head closer.